Oh, hello. You can edit that one out, please. <laughs> mm, good shot. The good thing is I'm playing so bad that Stuart won't have any idea which club to take. <laughs> I think it's just a little short. What a shot. Nice. Great bird. Six down. <laughs> we'll take that one. I think just to see how you get on with any other club, okay. it's gotta be the hunter. It's probably my favorite club in the bag. Hi guys, welcome to Battle Golf. A new series brought to you by the Bogeyman Podcast in where one of us will take on one of Ireland's elite amateurs or professionals in a nine hole match play. The thing about match play is that if you lose the hole, you also lose a club. Let's go and find out who we're playing. First up is Stuart Grant. Stewie is prepping for the Irish Challenge, so no doubt the challenge of playing Johnny in Powers Court is going to be high on his list of priorities. Now, guys, my second match in Battle Golf. I'm joined by Stuart Grant. Stuart, you, Stuart you've been uh, working away. This is this is the big match for you now. Yeah, today. it is. This is a big match. I've hence lost in a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, but um, no, I've been at home practicing away, uh, doing my bit. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. How has um, lockdown training been for you? It's been good. Yeah, it's actually it was actually a bit of a uh, a relief for me to in a, in a way because I had to work on a couple of things so it was actually I know it was an awful time is really tough on a lot of people but uh, for my actual golf it was actually really good so I'm quite excited for the year ahead so we'll get the first preview as to what you're yeah working yeah on now. exactly yeah we'll see how we get on here looking forward to this that's <laughs> that's worrying for me <laughs> uh, I wasn't well, I flipped a coin earlier on so you have the, the you have the honor okay nice okay good stuff so first hole on the Eastern Paris court, it is slightly dog-like, uh, right par four. Um, light, wide landing area into a pretty undulating green which runs from front left to back right. Stu at hybrid off the first. Fabulous strike. Super shot. Stewie straight down the middle. Johnny now. Johnny with the right miss now, bearing in mind Johnny has just run from the 10th tee of his first match yeah, right. Got a line. into this yeah, match right. against Stewie. It's a high right miss, <laughs> picking up where it left off. <laughs> and remarkably, Johnny has decided to take no shots whatsoever from a touring pro. So this is a flat match, Johnny against uh, Stuart Grant. Stewie with 6 iron. That looks left. Top of the hill left for Stewie. Wrong club. Tough up and in. Nice strike though. High cut. <laughs> it's the only shot I know, it seems. 183. Johnny from the bunker on the right hand side, 183. It'd be tough to get this up over that lip. That lip is actually quite close. Oh, too much cut. He's done a great job. Is that all right? That'll make this game easy for myself. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's a tricky one, all right. It's a, yeah, but it's <laughs> yeah, not too ma sure made unnecessarily hard. <laughs> I know. I know. I'm not, I don't know either. I'm not a great spot either. This is a tough up and down for Johnny. Short side on the right hand side. Clunky lie. Hopefully he can get up quick enough. And he can't. Lucky. It was a tough lie. It was sitting down nasty. As Stewie said, that was sitting pretty nasty. The good thing is I'm playing so bad that Stuart won't have any idea which club to take because I don't want to know if it's going to help me or hurt me. This is, everything is awful. It's not great up here either. I'd, I'd take your chances. <laughs> yeah. Stu, a bit of a bit of a wild pull for his on his second. He's left himself with a pretty tricky shot here. He's about ten yards above the height of the oh, green. Oh no! And that's taken off. I think we landed that a foot further. It would be a lot closer. These paragol greens are rapid. Johnny with his fourth. Oh, let's try. That nice. nearly hit. So Johnny's looking at five Stewie for par. Oh, hello. He takes that down. Johnny's one down. <laughs> More importantly, he's down one club. Yeah, scrappy, but it's in the hole. <laughs> so, what's the first victim? What's your favourite club? Uh, right now, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what's your least favourite club? Because that's probably your favourite, then, if you're going to tell me. 
I don't know, I think consult with Dave. What have I, what's, what have I been hidden? Not terrible. Yeah, the <laughs> yeah, was probably the worst. Okay, I'll actually take the driver. So Stewie has gone the for the driver out of Johnny's bag. I'm gonna let me off. I'm gonna go from there. That's, that's, the, that's an act of mercy. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't go for the putter either. No, I was thinking about the putter, but I don't know. Second on the east is a dog leg short par five. You carry the bunker on the left, which leaves you a tough shot in because you're faced with these three trees right in the middle of the fairway. So you kind of need to be one or other side, but tough approach, second out, big second shot hole is. I'm thinking th three wood at them people. So they're just kind of walking now, just there. I generally hit a bit of a cut. So if I just, if I hit a good enough strike, I think should carry that bunker. Three wood at the people. It's what, it's what, 260 to carry that bunker or something? Uh, yeah, I have enough in this if I hit it, hit it all right. Um, a little downhill too. Three wood at these people. I wonder what those people ever did to Stewie. So three wood off the tee. Oh that, ladies and gentlemen, is a frozen rope. Beautiful draw. Little low. Hope know. those people were safe. Johnny with three wood. Mm, good shot. Maybe you should have took that club. He did say. <laughs> Johnny with his second, with five wood. Unlucky. Unlucky. Yeah. And that is not in a good spot for Johnny. Stewie's actually going nine iron here, so three wood nine iron into this par five. Ideal line right of the trees. He should draw it around, which he's done. Oh, savage. Wind just pushing it. Hmm. Maybe a hair long. Johnny from a tough light, left of the ferry. Carry, carry. Oh, Fatigue lucky. is setting in for Johnny, I think. Test the one. I think for my benefit, this is going to be a very short game. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, strange things have happened. Not that strange. <laughs> You're not catching me at my best. <laughs> far, far from it. Johnny had to run from the ninth green of his last game to the first on this game against Stewie, so fatigue will play a factor. Yeah, very He's also faced with the toughest shot in golf. From 50 yards. Oh, Whoa, too much. Straight faced wedge. Unlucky. It's pretty good effort now, in fairness. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, it's like the hardest shot in golf, that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I was like, this is either going to go into the next bunker or <laughs> way long into the far bunker, so. Jerry, what do you hit those shots at? 52. 52. Open the face or leave it? Yeah, because uh, when you open a 52, it already adds the bounce anyway. Johnny, from the back bunker, he was unlucky to get to here. Nice. Nice shot. Thanks. Stewie's face was long, long eagle putt. All the wind. Looking for the wind all up. These greens are quick in Paris Court. Holes, that's true. Not too bad. So Stewie for birdie to go two up. And most importantly, take another club out of Johnny's bag. Johnny, remember, has given Stewie no shots, which is extraordinary. Great bird. Well done. What are you working on at the moment? So what were you doing during lockdown in terms of? A lot of things had to change. Um, my driving was just not good enough. So I had to change my technique. I used to get very steep on it and stuff like that. So I've kind of worked a lot on my on my setup, my posture, and then um, my my takeaway and, and stuff like that. So it was a it was kind of a strenuous practice, um, repetitive, like you know, just kind of chipping shots, getting into position and stuff like that. But like luckily now, I'm kind of past all that, and it's it's pretty much automatic now on the course, which is nice. You just have to kind of manage it. Seems to be in a pretty good way. Yeah, yeah, I'm very happy now with uh, how things are. Um, like I'm actually like I'm really excited to play now. Whereas last year, you know, it was just or the year before it was just you know you're walking onto the first tee and you don't know where the ball is going to go. You know, so I know that. <laughs> <laughs> I live in that world. Yeah, yeah, but um, so yeah, no, I'm excited. I'm really excited now. Just just need to keep a you know a good mindset going forward and embrace the challenge, I guess. So. Kind of when did you start working with Dave? About nine months ago. So that, 
yeah, I, I, I need a, yeah, I need a big change. Yeah, it was, it wasn't like my iron play was was really really strong in my putting, but my driving was just costing me every round, like three shots, and um, you know playing in the trees and stuff like that. So it doesn't help when you're trying to <laughs> make a bit of money. <laughs> um, so we'll take the putter. We'll take the putter. We'll take the putter yeah. Well, thank you for yourself. Well, <laughs> yeah, so. that's very true. Well, that might be gone after this hole. <laughs> Terry Paris put short on the east in Paris called short part three, guarded by bunkers, tiered green. Tough one to get this close. Oh no. That wasn't very good. Kick. It'll work out though. Yeah, wasn't my best. I was trying to take a little bit off and just didn't, didn't release it. It's got very windy. It has. I'll try and use that as an excuse. <laughs> so Johnny now down his putter and driver. He is hitting wedge. That looks a little left. Hopefully he doesn't catch that slope down. Chipping into the wind. Chipping into the wind, yeah. <laughs> very very positive. So yeah. Very positive. Just, I'm trying to I'm trying to just give you a bit of encouragement. <laughs> Gotta, gotta get there first. <laughs> the Johnny with that uphill chip they were describing. Johnny needs to get a move on here. He's two down, lost two clubs. Needs to get this close. Get out of here with a half. Oh, gotta get there first. It's on the green. <laughs> <laughs> just a bit. Just, just. <laughs> oh, I have a filthy putt here. I don't think I'll struggle getting this to the hole anyway. Be a nice one to throw, in, throw into the cup. These sloping greens in Barrett's Court are tough. This is quick. Takes off down the slope, should move to his right. Pretty good pace. Great touch. Cheers. Great touch. That's good. Roll it in. I have to. <laughs> that is gone. Johnny with his three wood to for par. Well, that's not going to do it. That was unlucky. <laughs> it was a pretty good effort. Good effort nice from Johnny. I think you're right. We'll take that one next. <laughs> but he is now three down in the match. And down three clubs. So the fourth is short par four with trouble everywhere. You have a massive banking slope to the right. Bunker short left for those who want to take the green on. She will be going with driver here. Johnny only has five wood in the bag. I think if I hit one good shot here, it should be enough, maybe. You wouldn't know. Well, considering I'm hitting five wood. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and you're putting with I'm a three wood. It's yeah, a little, little tricky, all right. I'm already giving up a, <laughs> a lot of yardage on top of the just general abilities. Two, 292 meters. Yeah, no chance. All right. No. I believe in you. <laughs> Go after it. I will. Stu, a driver. This is something he said he has been working on with his new coach, Dave Roddy, over the last nine months. So let's see how it's working out for him. <laughs> Told it. Stu, right at the middle. Johnny with five wood. Mm, that is right. Ah! With a shout. Just in case. <laughs> Still open, though, isn't it? Probably just like, why is he being filmed? He is shite. <laughs> they would be correct. Johnny from the right of the fourth ferry. Johnny's getting a bit down on himself. We, can, we, we, need to, we want Johnny to get back here. This is, this is a tough shot. Johnny to get back to the green. Up there. Came out nice. I think it's gonna hair left. Yeah. Alright. I hit a tree. <laughs> Stewie from left of the bunker from 60 yards. And that is so close. What a shot. Oh! <laughs> I think it's just a little short. No, no, no. I'll play it. <laughs> I, want to, I want to get onto the green. Yeah, you could shoot it in. <laughs> I would have to hold it, yeah. <laughs> Johnny realistically needs to hold this for a half. Uh, 
Uh, congratulations. Well <laughs> Thank you. Johnny is now four down after four. The agony continues. Okay, so four, you're four up to four. <laughs> Not too bad. Um, you got another club you can take. Got one. I'm hitting eight, so I'm, I'm going to go with six iron. Yeah. Six iron? Is that what it, that yeah. about right? <laughs> we'll take that one. Maybe go with the seven. <laughs> a demoralised Johnny going to the tee with a seven iron after losing a six to two, so the fifth is a beast of a par three. 185 to 190 meters downhill. Tiered green, uh, surrounded by bunkers. Dave was totally right. He said just there, next time we're playing a tour pro, it's just play off your hand again. <laughs> play with the shots. Trying to beat a tour yeah. pro. Hard, hard gone. Yeah. Trying to beat a tour pro at half golf back. Yeah. And playing awful. Yeah, you're not playing your best in fairness. No. This is Chewy with eight from 192. <laughs> He's just so positive. Unbelievable shot. Just a different level of strike from Chewy there. Ooh. Ooh. Did stall. Pretty happy with the shot though. Yeah. There's a window. Did you take five or seven? Iron. Seven. Okay. But I'm regretting it now and the buggy's <laughs> so far away. What you hit eight, did you? I hit eight, yeah. yeah um, so just not getting there. I thought it was enough, but yes, yeah, it's, it's ten yards out. This is just the wrong club, bro. <laughs> Johnny determined to go at seven here, could have walked back to the bag for five, but he has hit a yeah, bullet. He's played it and then it's perfect. Stay there. Good shot. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it wasn't. <laughs> Johnny up the back of five with a long putt with five wood. That needs to take the slope. Oh, come on. Yeah. That was pretty good. Isn't lucky. Really unlucky from Johnny. So Stewie from the front left bunker. Oh! Oh! Open for Johnny. Edit that, that, you can edit that one out, please. <laughs> we certainly will not, Stuart. On a scale of one to really hard, how hard is this shot? Because it's downwind as well, it's got to be, got to be an eight or nine, I think. Stuart has put himself in a bad old spot here. Johnny actually has a chance to get a hole back. Yeah, pretty tough. Okay, maybe 10. <laughs> 10 out of 10 for difficulty for this one for Stewie. So, downhill lie. Green running away from you and downwind. He does have his name on his bag though. Oh. That is so good. Sit, sit. He will take that every time. Pretty happy with that. That's a great <laughs> shot. Stewie has that for four. Go Johnny for the, for the win to go back to three down. And he's dragged that a bit left. These are not given either. So Stewie for four. Johnny has a put for four also. to go for Stuart to stay four up. Oh, He's wow. missed it. Johnny has a chance here. That's good. <laughs> Johnny with his five volt from three, three and a half feet. He's good with these. He's been practicing. Nice. Well done. <laughs> Johnny gets a hole back. Three down, and he gets a club off Stewie. Most importantly. Oh, Stu, that wasn't great for me. It's all good. What club are you going to take? 
this is huge. I really didn't think I'd ever get to this point. <laughs> and it was not through any skill or talent on my part at all. It's got to be the putter, really. <laughs> I, I, think, I think just to see how you get on with any other club, okay. it's got to be the putter. Fair enough. That's fair. I think that was a good choice. It's probably my favourite club in the bag. Really? <laughs> yeah. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, to not lose five and four is a uh, relief. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a little, <laughs> You're like, I'm a little uh, upset. <laughs> I'm a little annoyed about that. <laughs> Stewie a bit disappointed I didn't sweep Johnny. Yeah, Johnny with five, but this power five is a bit of a beast back into the wind. Nice. Very good. Nice. Good swing. Cheers. Good swing from Johnny. Let's get this. Took a while, but I got there. Yeah. Oh, is it? Took a while. Stewie with driver. Just needs to start up the left and just peel off that bunker, which he has done with a plum. Yeah, that's perfect. Johnny from a long way back, he's got five wood again. He's just trying to make progress here. Strike. And another yeah, peach nice. from Johnny. Nice. Johnny's coming back into this. All right, fresh match, right? This is the first one. <laughs> yeah, we'll start again. <laughs> Lovely. Thank you. Nice. Good tempo. Cheers. Yeah, so when, like, if there's trouble on the left, I generally tee the ball a little bit down. I hate it in the left, so if I tee it down, I try and like squeeze one out there, and like I, I know in the back of my head that I'll never hit it left if I tee it down. So yeah, because like the, it was a pretty flat trajectory. Yeah, flat trajectory. Yeah, yeah. Um, and I can hit as hard as I want then without having to worry about it going left. So that's the idea behind it. It was huge. What yeah, it was a nice what, flight. What have you got left on this? I think I have like uh, 195. So. <laughs> Yeah, we'll see how we get on here. I'm trying to figure out the wind. Yeah, I think it's just straight off the left. So. That was a huge hit from Sue. 195 left. Yards, take it. So that, that drive went 310 into the wind. What a shot. It's the right number, it should be pretty good. That is superb from Ooh. Sue. He will have a 25 foot your put. Trust. <laughs> it's fantastic. <laughs> that was insane. Yeah, it might be, might be pretty close, we'll see. <laughs> might be pretty close. <laughs> if there's any, any, <laughs> any doubt. Great job, that's so good. Johnny, you're still in this though. What would you use in this situation? Fairway bunker, 84 yards to the pin. 84. I'd probably like, try and hit like a 52 and like pick it. Because if you hit like a full shot at 60 here, it's just gonna go straight it's up into the good. wind, yeah. That'd be kind of my thoughts. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, look, I'll take your advice. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know you're, what you're doing. So as Johnny said, he's 84 yards left from this fairway bunker. Tough shot to kick clean. Whoa. I was closer than you think. Oh, he's hit that too clean. Pretty difficult shot. It's tough, yeah. yeah it's tough shot. Is, that kind of yardage is tough. Very tough, yeah. And he's flown everything by the looks of it. I feel like the hole was <laughs> pretty, pretty much conceded at this point anyway. I actually find that shot harder now than I would like say a 30 yard bunker shot. Yeah. Because it has to be just perfect. So Johnny from the jungle at the back of the six. Really needs to get this up and down. Unfortunately he hasn't, he's still in there. So it looks like it's going to be game set match this Stewie. At three down. She is putting with his driver. How's that look? <laughs> it looks like you're putting with a driver, all right. <laughs> Stewart driver for Eagle. Oh, God. oh. A bit steamy. It actually wasn't too bad. So this is the first time we've seen anyone oh, pull with driver on battle golf. <laughs> I hit a few for the hole, I think, anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And he safely makes par and All takes right. that game with Johnny. <laughs> four and three. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I won't be trying that full time, but probably get no. used to it. <laughs> yeah, I've had pretty okay apart from one hole, so. 
Yeah, oh, yeah. You let you let me away with one on, on that. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much for doing this. We really appreciate it. Oh, you right, uh, so didn't catch me at my finest, but no, I you... didn't. I got lucky today. I think. I, got lucky. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think you're okay, but going forward, definitely going to be taking shots off the tour pros. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Your game's in fantastic shape. You're playing really well. Yeah, yeah, quite comfortable now. So yeah, I'm looking forward to you know get going now in two weeks. I'm excited. So run, run us through the next two weeks real quick. Yeah, it'd be a lot of kind of like uh, stressful practice. Um, you know, try, my, me and my coach are going to try and put myself under the gun as much as possible to try and simulate tournament golf. But um, yeah, a little bit of that and more so playing than practice because we're coming into the season now. So that'd be kind of my schedule in the next couple of weeks. So people can keep an eye on you. You'll be playing EuroPro this season and a few Yeah, Challenge EuroPro Tour. and Challenge Tour, yeah. So a few of them um, and stuff like that. Yeah, so I'm excited. Very nice to see. Stuart Grand, thank you very much for joining for joining us in this. Thank episode. you, thanks for having me. Yeah, it was great fun, yeah. So the bogeymen are two losses and one win. That's admirable. I'll, I'll take that. I'll take that so far. Best game I've played in a long time. So one down, a lost ball, no driver, no putter. Three would looking really dodgy at the moment. Great, thanks for having me, lads. Lads, I haven't felt this pressure in a long time.